How do you know if your assessment tasks are any good? How do you test the quality of an assessment task? Take a moment and think about your own experiences as a student. What memories do you have of a really good or really bad assessment task? When did you feel angry or disappointed in a task you were given and why? Pause here and write down your response for five minutes and then share it on the forums below. Have you got it? Was it an exam with trick questions that tested your language ability rather than your actual knowledge of the subject? Or perhaps it was a group project where the marks were distributed regardless of the work each person put into it. Or where the weighting of the grades was disproportionate to the actual effort put into the course. Can you give a name to why the assessment task was unfair? Quality requirements help us define where problems lie in assessment. For instance, validity. Does the assessment adequately measure what it's intending to measure? Were the learning objectives tested and graded at the right level? Did the amount of work that the student was asked to do correspond to the importance of the learning objective? And do the results help you draw correct conclusions? Next, we have effectivity. Does the assessment actually help students learn? For instance, a multiple choice exam for programming where students work towards passing rather than actually understanding a programming task is an example of a really ineffective assessment. This also speaks to whether there are actual feedback moments before the grading and whether your task enables regular studying. Then we have reliability in both test taking and in grading. So similar students taking a similar test should have similar grades. And a student who scores 90% in all of their assignments shouldn't suddenly receive 40% on a test. This means that questions and assignments are clear and tests are comparable over the years. They're equally difficult and equally difficult on the same learning objectives. Moreover, the type of questions, whether open-ended or multiple choice questions, do not influence the grade. And if the lecturer is having a bad hair day, or perhaps a different marker picks up your rubric, this should not affect the grade itself. But we'll talk a little bit more about reliability again and how to fix it in another video. Next, we have issues of transparency. Students should know how to get a good grade and why they get a low grade. This means that you are transparent about the grading criteria, grade weights, and about the assessment itself. There should be no tricks and no surprises. If you minus points, that should be explicitly stated within your syllabus. Then, a very important one for all of us is the issue of practicability, and this speaks to issues for both staff and students. Do students have enough time and resources to complete the task and get 100%? And then, do you have enough time to grade and provide sufficient feedback for the task within your own working hours? If not, it's not a practical assignment. Can you give a name to what made the tasks you dealt with as a student unfair or bad? Write them down in the course forums, adding to your previous comment. And as a bonus, I want you to think about your experiences of great assessment. What made them great? Which quality requirements did they meet? Share these with us on the course forums down below and discuss each other's posts. I look forward to seeing your examples.